Welcome to DBeaver's YouTube channel. Today, we're going to talk about export data from CloudBeaver. In addition to working with data for editing and research, CloudBeaver allows its users to export entire tables or parts of tables in 10 different formats. You can use files with data in Excel or Google Sheets, but first, you have to know how to download it. There are three ways to download all the necessary data from the Data Navigator, Data Editor, or SQL Editor. Today we'll show you how to use each of them. Suppose your colleagues have already created the connection with the table you need. In that case, you need to log into your company account. You can then locate the database in the tree of objects and expand the list of tables in it. How to export data from Data Navigator. Imagine your team needs to contact clients and get feedback from the people on the list. You can take the customer's data from a spreadsheet that your colleagues have compiled. To export the whole table, you can download it directly from the tree of objects. To do this, select Export from the context menu next to the object name. From the list of suggested export formats, you need to choose XLSX and the export configuration opens. After clicking the Next button, select Export. Then click Download in the pop-up dialog. The download will start immediately. The advantage of this exporting method is that it's quick and simple, and you don't even have to look at the data in detail. All you have to do is choose the right connection in the tree of objects. This method has disadvantages when working with larger tables. For example, exporting a spreadsheet file takes time and processing and filtering such large data sets in Excel is difficult. How to export data using Data Editor If the previous export option doesn't work for you, you can select only the necessary data from the table in CloudBeaver. This can be done through the Filter field in the Data Editor. For example, you do not need the whole table, but only the user's data with the orders that total more than 200. In the Filter field, you should enter the column's name, sign, and number to filter the object for your task. You can learn more about how to use the Filter field in our video about the Data Editor in CloudBeaver. In the bottom toolbar of the Data Editor, click Export and go through the same sequence of actions as when exporting from Data Navigator. A filtered table loads faster, and the amount of data does not interfere with the proper functioning of Excel. How to export a filtered table by running queries in SQL Editor. Let's move on to the third method of exporting, through a query in the SQL Editor. This method will come in handy, for example, if you need filtered data and not all the columns from the table. Suppose you need the data of users who have placed orders for more than 200, along with the data of their companies and the countries they come from. So you must write the correct SELECT statement and run it. Add the names of necessary columns like country, company with contact information, and total, and the WHERE clause with the name of the country you need. You can watch our video about simple SELECT queries. After performing the query, you'll see the result set. The table can be exported using the Export button in the bottom toolbar because the result set looks and works exactly like the data editor. As in the previous cases, you should select the XLSX format and click Download in the pop-up dialog. As you can see, there are three different ways to export data in CloudBeaver. We hope the next time you decide to export data from our browser-based solution, you'll know exactly which way works best for you. We'll tell you more about the features of our browser-based tool in the upcoming videos on the dBeaver channel. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and set your bell to learn about new videos.